Welcome to another episode of Minecraft Oasis, but today is Sunday, which means Super Oasis Sunday, which means BAM! Face cam and a full hour of uncut Minecraft gameplay. So, I am now back at my house. Last where I left off, I was so lost, and I actually went back to an old world save and looked up uh, the coordinates and I was so far away I don't even know but I found a bunch of other places um, in the time of me being lost so I marked Oasis but I found the mushroom forest again where we found the mushrooms I found a lake village um, that's that has snow and then I found oh no wait those are two separate villages. I found a lake village and a snow village. So I found two other villages and I found a tropical biome. Um, so, and I do have my other village over here. So let's just go visit. Um, I don't even, this can just be desert village, but I am super happy that I found my way back. Uh, now I'm not even sure who I want to get my husband from because there are other villages, there's, you know, you never know. I may have a mate that's more suitable for me over there, but let me go ahead and mark this waypoint. This is going to be a uh, sand village. And we're gonna make this like a sandy color. Let's do that. Can I even make, here we go. That's a sandy color, right? Kind of, kind of. I think I have one that is, I think that's the color that Oasis is. So I'm just gonna make this one. Mm, how about a green? I, I want like a light, there we no. There we go. All right. So we have a lot of other villages that we've explored and found. Let's exit the menu and I'm actually gonna, oh, these guys are sleeping. I don't, whoa. Look at all of them sleeping out here. That's creepy. They don't like to go in their houses. So I'm gonna go fly away. And I'm gonna actually go sleep too um, because I do wanna find a husband today. But I was supposed to, uh, that's what I was doing when I went out and search, search for some coral reef. That's the reason why I got lost. So I'm gonna have to put some coral reef down below in this area here, in my little oasis. I do wanna work on my garden um, and I wanna get some birds and more bird baths. Let's go ahead and just get off of our horse. What? No, I didn't wanna, okay, that was weird. Okay, so I'm gonna go in. We're just gonna sleep and I'm gonna have to, today I really wanna work on my garden and still no ham ham, still no ham ham. Um, make my house look a little nicer and um, get the koi fish. So that's what I really wanna do today. That's my goal, but who knows uh, if I'll even come close to com com completing all of those. Okay, um, so first I guess I can just Let's see how the coral reef are. Um, I can go down there. Uh, let's see, okay, so I'm gonna love having these displayed. I should actually have some coral reef on display over here. Like, yeah, look at this coral reef. Look at what I found, what I got. Okay, I don't know where I'm gonna put it though. I feel like I should get rid of this ginormous picture and I feel like maybe I should even change this wall wallpaper because you won't really be able to see it as good. It's kind of too, too contrasting. So, hmm. I really want to decorate with, um, no, no, no. I think it's a, is it a shift click or I have to have nothing in my hands so I can open the whole thing. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's see. Let's put this crappy compass away because it doesn't, <sighs> didn't do anything. I'm going to put my glass up here. I'm just gonna put it just for storage. Um, oh look, let's put all of our flowers. I got a ton of flowers, um, but I'm gonna take this down. We're gonna take the coral, the aloe. Aloe is actually a flower, right? Aloe vera, 
Isn't that supposed to be like really good for your skin? And we'll put this there as well. So I'll have some pretty flowers on display. Um, put the glass, the wood, the fish. I don't really need this right now. That's why I'm just kind of putting it on display uh, instead of putting it inside of the chest. Okay, so let's just go down. I'm not sure how coral reef work works. Oh, oh, you're supposed, no, get out of there. Get out of there, sugar lumps. Let's go take her up. I don't want her swimming in the water because um, something dangerous may lurk in the water. So we don't want that. Okay, okay, okay. So I'm gonna have to let's get off and I'm gonna go down. So I hope you guys are having an awesome weekend. Um, this should be a long weekend for some of you guys who live here in the US. Um, hello, wait, oh, you're not mine. I have Krabby, Maddie, Patty, and Fatty over there. All of my crabs. Um, but yeah, this long weekend is coming to an end and I am, it's uh, Saturday morning when I'm filming this. I went to the beach yesterday all day, which is the 5th. We were literally there the whole day. We got there at 9.30 in the morning and left at 10 at night. So I was just so tired and I got a, a lot of sun, so I'm a little burnt, <laughs> if you can tell. So wait, let me, I hope there's no piranhas over here. Look, it's Dory. Okay, so I'm wondering how this net works. Did I put my fish here? Oh, I didn't. Okay, look, I'm really curious. <gasps> That's a cool looking fish. I caught him! I caught him! Oh my gosh, okay. I'm gonna have to get so many nets. That's the cool looking one. It's the one that has the little light that comes over his head so he can see. That is cool. So I'm gonna see if I can actually plant some coral. Let's see. So maybe... I don't know. I'm supposed to, I'm supposed to put it on sand maybe? Not sure exactly how this works. Oh, there's a cat in the water. Okay. So, I don't know if it's supposed to go, like, really deep. Or if it's supposed to just go, like, on dirt. Or if I can even put it down. Darn. I don't even know if I could put it down. Let's see. Let's grab this and sea coral and this one, too. A dry coral. Kitty! Stop killing my fish. Stop killing my fish. Okay, can I put this down? I could put this down. Okay, so we have that. Uh, was there anything else that I grabbed or was that all of the, the coral that I had? I'm trying to see if it'll harvest itself and just spread. Oh, it's, there we go. Now I can, okay. So then what about this one? Let's put that down. <laughs> it's a dolphin. It's only a dolphin. Oh, kitty. No. Why are you so hostile, cat? I will own you. Get back! I love how my sword makes like really, really loud. Like it's like it's this ginormous sword it makes really loud damage noise, and there's just a fish swimming by. Okay, you're gonna die, cat. Last hit. I love this damage in. Oh, give me those. The damage indicators, really cool. Okay, uh, let's go up. And I'm gonna put down. I should have collected this stuff because I didn't realize that's where. It goes on. Let's put it down here. There we go. We only have three. So I can plant this pink one. And this one as well. I think I have another one too. Or no, those are the only ones that I had. So I could plant this green one. But you know what? I think I need to just collect. I don't think they're going to spread, to be honest. We can let it try and see and let it see if it works um i can always go back now that i know how to get home i should really have i should have marked the coral um dang i should have oh kid they don't hurt the fish i should have marked where the coral reef stuff was i'm gonna i'm gonna dig this back up because i'm gonna have the coral inside we're gonna have it where the koi fish are gonna be just for looks inside so Something is sucking me in again. What is it? Here we go. 
Let's grab that. There we go. We got all of our coral back. So now I know that I don't collect the bushy part. I have to collect the base. Drop the base. And then that will drop both the little um, place where it needs to stand on and the actual coral. So I'm not going to put too much. Actually, I want to put um, glowstone down here. I'm just going to give it to myself. <laughs> I'm just gonna give myself glowstone because I don't want to go. Oh, oops. I don't want to go into the nether. No. Scary places. Okay, so let's put it down. We'll put it down here in all four corners because this is going to be. Ooh, I need my shovel back. This is gonna be a pretty shallow. I'm gonna have to dig my way out of here. So this is really gonna be shallow. And since I have the dirt down here, I could do this already. Maybe some some of them we can put dirt and some of them we could put coral. So maybe, let's see, we'll put dirt around this. And we don't have very much coral. Um, how about we just, I want it to look a little nice. So we have the dry coral. Let's put a dry coral right here and Sea coral here, here, and there. Oh, wow. So symmetrical. Okay. And then the rest of it will be covered with dirt. Um, but I need to go grab some more. Um, so let me get this wool. Let me just get out of here. I'm going to go collect some more dirt. And then we, sh we can rele start releasing our fish in, in there as well. So I already have one fish that's caught. Um, I'm pretty excited because... It's gonna look awesome. I'm just like hoping that that coral doesn't disappear because it doesn't have water. And probably a bad idea. I probably should have waited until I was completely ready. But let's try and do this really quickly. I'm gonna have to collect some water too. I wonder if I can collect water from the uh, bird bath. That might be possible. And I think that is enough. Oh, look guys. It's an ant. Oh! Little ant. I want a little ant farm. Can I? Can I collect them? I hope I can collect all the animals and just. You know what would be really cool, is if I could collect like butterflies, and then pin them on my wall or put them in a frame or even make um, a little butterfly uh, cage with all of them in there. Okay, so let's go down. Okay, so I'm going to cover the rest of this, but I'm going to put the water down first before I lay down the coral, just, just in case. But let's get rid of this and let's use dirt to climb up, because I don't know if I'm going to, I think I can reach that. All right, so now I just need to get a bucket of water. Where's my bucket of water? Or where's my bucket in general? I'm going to need to eat something. I can't make a meal. I don't even know if I have... Um, that mod anymore where I make I can make a bunch of different foods. I don't know if I do. I might not. Oh, do I have bread here. Didn't even realize that. Okay. So let's eat some bread and I think the sun is setting. Um where's my bucket? Where is my bucket? Mr. Bucket. Boop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop. No? No bucket? Okay, let's go check upstairs. I may have left it in the cult vat. Because they like, they use the milk. Oh, here we go. Well, they're all full of milk. I'm going to go to sleep. And then we're going to empty this. And fill it up. And then we'll have some fish in a little pond. And it'll be fancy looking. And then I think I need to spruce up my house a little bit. And then I need to go impress a man. I really need to impress a man. Let's go. Can I empty this? Where am I going to empty the milk? Who? Where is that cat? Oh! Look, it's a big snake in the water. Oh my gosh, it's an anaconda. Is it? It's not an anaconda, is it? It looks really dangerous. I don't want to go near there. Okay, so I'm going to go... I'm going to empty the water over here. Um, or the milk. Or I'm drinking it. <laughs> I just drank it instead. So there we have water. I have to drink this milk too. And... 
Um, I should probably just make, I think we have an endless pit in the house somewhere because I don't want to have to cut, keep coming back down here to fill up the water. I don't have my sink anymore, which was my endless pit, but let's try to work this out. See how it goes. I don't have a sink anymore. That makes me sad. Um, I'm just, I think I'm going to make one endless pit really fast really quickly here. So let's just place it down right here. There we go. There will be our endless pit. So it won't be so difficult for us to fill this up. All right. So I guess I should start. I don't know if I could just pour it down. <gasps> Stegosaurus is hungry. Uh Oh, Oh, we got to feed him. Okay. So I'm going to just start like this. I'm going to put a bucket of water here. Now I can't get up. Not smart. Okay. So let's grab some water. I should have just filled up the buckets when I was up here. I don't know why I didn't think of that. Okay, I'm going to try to make this. No, Stegosaurus. Don't be hungry. I need to feed him. I need to go feed him. Shoot. But, oh, dang. I don't know. You know what? I should probably go check on him right now. Because uh, if the ferns aren't working anymore, I'm totally going to be screwed. Because that's how they were getting their food. I can give them wheat. So let's go see. Let's go see how our stegosaurus is. I need to make um, a feeder for them. But I didn't really have to worry about that because they had, they had the, um, the ferns that would grow and spread. Boar, what are you doing in here? Hey, no! I was just trying to be nice to you. I was going to let you live. And then you were just completely rude to me. Okay, so let's go up. See how our stegosauruses are doing. I'm glad it gives us a warning. Because that will be bad. Okay. No, stegosaurus. Don't be hungry. <gasps> Look. See, the, they don't even eat the ferns. These ferns aren't good. Close Dang it. Are they just not full grown or what? Oh, let's see. Which one is it? Do I not have my... Oh, I don't have my book. I think it may have disappeared. What was that noise? Was it the Stegosaurus? Are you hungry? Okay. Oh, come here. Come here. Two. Oh, let's feed them both. There we go. I have to feed them by hand. Oh, you know, hungry. You know, hungry stegosaurus. Okay, well, they didn't take too much wheat. That wasn't too much food. I should probably just make a feeder for them. I'm really sad that the 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 ferns don't work anymore. That was com that was totally easy. How are my No! Where did they go? My other two dinos! Well, I had to just spawn them in. They're not really completely mine yet, but what the heck? I didn't really... I don't remember seeing anything that they died or were hungry. Okay, well, we'll have to worry about that later because we're still kind of figuring out... I guess the ferns don't work anymore because if they were hungry, they would have ate them. And it doesn't seem like they're growing. They don't look the same. That makes me very sad. But we'll, we'll have to plant some more dinos. I'm going to just spawn in their eggs because um, when, I, when I had reloaded the world after we updated, uh, they were missing anyways. So I spawned them in. Or the eggs at least. Okay, but I'm going to worry about my fish because I really want a fish. And this ham ham's never coming back. Okay, so let's get our buckets back. There we go. And let's fill this up with some Wawa. We're feeding the coral. Let's see, let's put one here. And in the corners. Here we go. I don't want it because I, I could just do it from the top and then put it down, but I don't want it to, the water to run down and I don't know if it's still gonna do it. I don't know if this is gonna make a difference, but we'll see. Okay, so that's that. Now I just need to remove this and 
you know, I should plant my, my coral right now. Might as well. Let's see. How many should we have? We'll have one of the pink ones. Oh, I can't plant it. I think it must be, it has to be deeper or something. Or maybe even it has to be, can't be exposed like that. So let's, uh, let's just try to add more water onto it and see. So I'm gonna just put water there. Let's go grab some more. Okay, this shouldn't take that long. That wasn't too painful. All right, and I'm gonna place it on this side. And where did my, oh, I'll just use the wool. Okay, so I gotta lay this down so I have something to put the water against. Okay, so let's put one here and, oh, why did I do that? No, I needed you. I need you, bucket of water. Let's put this one on the floor. There we go. Okay, I need to grab some more water. Or I had one bucket left. I think we don't have to go in right there. We could just do it from this side. There we go. And do one from here. And there. So hopefully it's going to be flat. And hopefully we can plant our coral reef. If not, I think I may have to just put the coral on top of... Um, on top of a piece of dirt because that's how it is in the wild so that water is calm now let's get rid of the wool here we go and let's see if we could put down our coral and hopefully we can and then we can start putting some fish inside and hopefully the coral doesn't eat the fish because I know sometimes it does let's see I'll have to <gasps> we did it we did it! Wait, that was weird when I went. Why am I? Oh, why is this there? We need to get rid of this. Well, I mean, I guess I could leave it there for now until I need to get out. But the water looks weird under here. Okay, let's let's see what other corals we're gonna put down. I'm gonna put down this one, that one, and that one. So we'll see if they if they do spread. It may. I don't know. If they were to spread, they would spread in here. So we're gonna make just a little farm for it. And um, I need to get out of here. So let's place some dirt there. I don't think I even need this dirt on the bottom right here. Come on, a little dirt. There we go. Okay, so I can get out right there. Okay, now I'm gonna let a fish go in here and see if it's the same fish that I caught. He's our pet. Okay, so we get to name him. Um, let's see, what should we name them after? Because all my fish should have a theme. They should be called like sushi, different types of sushi. <laughs> I can name this one uh, like different roles. I'm gonna name this one the California. California, California roll. Is California. Oh, he's so cute. Okay, so I'm gonna go outside and I'm gonna go catch some more fish. I, I should make another, mm, do I have enough? Oh, I was like, what is that? It's a hopper. Um, I think, let's see, net. Do I have enough? I, do I have enough to make? No, I don't. Darn it. I only have three string left. String is very sparse in this oasis. Okay, so let's go catch some more fish. I'm gonna catch one of these big ones. Let's catch this one. Wait, can I catch that one? Or what about that one? That one's pretty. Ah! Come here! You're cute! I'm gonna, I want fish down here too in this one, but I'm, I don't wanna get attached because I probably will, and they'll probably die by like some tigers. So we'll just keep the fish that I have inside, and then I'm gonna put um, I'm gonna put glass on top of it, so we can walk on top of it. All right, and let's put down. What his what's his name gonna be? Um, so there's California. There's a va how about Philadelphia or a Vegas? A Vegas roll. Vegas rolls are good. I'm just naming them after. 
<laughs> different states here in uh, Al or the U.S. <laughs> we can. I was thinking of sushi, but... I mean, what if we name one dragon? Because dragon rolls are really good. Let's name one dragon. Let's name the big one dragon. If we can catch a big one. Dragon? Ah, oh, yeah! We got him! We are fishing with a net. This is awesome. My dreams have came true. And hopefully this will impress my husband. I should bring him over the house before uh, I decide to marry him. I don't want to rush into things. Seen what happened last time. Okay, so this is going to be dragon. Dragon! Oh, don't get hurt, dragon. This is so cool. I kind of want to leave... I don't know if I should leave it open because I don't think they need, they don't need, uh, can I give them seeds? I want to feed them. That would be cool if I had a little koi fish pond where I can go and feed the fish. That would be so awesome. Cause I don't know how I would feed these guys and they won't have any air bubbles or anything. Let's see, can I feed you? Whoa, dragon, dragon, whoa. It's okay, dragon. Can I feed him? Can I just drop these in there? Anybody want to nibble? Nibble on some seeds? Okay, they're getting stuck in the... <laughs> they're getting stuck in that. Maybe, hmm. Maybe I should place it in a different area. Because I want the koi fish to be able to swim around. Hmm. I guess I don't really need the coral reef. Who? Okay, I think I'm gonna take it out. Oh man, all right. I don't want them getting stuck in there. I want it for decoration though. Like I would love to put the coral reef right here. And I, I want more, <laughs> I want more, um, I want more fish. I wanna see like a big wall of fish where they could just swim around. And I, and I want a koi fish pond. So I'm gonna go to bed. Now I'm gonna take a sip of my coffee while I'm waiting. Mmm. 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 And let's go catch some more fish. And name them after different rolls. I'm gonna run out of rolls because those are my favorite ones. <laughs> oh, hello, little banana slug. Goodbye, little banana slug. Um, yeah, so I usually eat like the Vegas, Philadelphia, Dragon Roll. Those are my favorites and those are all I know. Okay, so what kind of fish is this? Whoa, I got him! This is fun. I like fishing. Um, I don't know if I could catch those fish. I don't know if I could catch the fishies. Um, okay, so what am I gonna name this one? This one can be the Philadelphia, but I don't know how to spell Philadelphia. <laughs> Let's get him in the water. Phil, Philadelphia. P H I L I D E L P H I A. I think that's right. <laughs> Hopefully, there's Philadelphia. <laughs> all right. Let's see what else can. What? Are, that's like that's the, all the roles that I know. What is it? Another roll. Red, do you know any sushi? I'm naming my fish after sushi. Mm -hmm. And I have four already. Dragon, Philadelphia, California, and Vegas. There's a crunch, crunchy roll. Crunchy! Crunchy? Uh, there is an eel roll. Oh, there is eel. Mm. What else? Avocado roll. I'm gonna get you. Avocado? That's uh -huh. a cute name. Um, a rainbow. Wow, you know sushi. I just, okay. I'm gonna name this one Rainbow. Oh, okay. Rainbow, roll, Rainbow rolls are good. Yes, they are. Okay. So I don't even know how many fish I should have in here. I think this will be the last one. I think this will be our last fish in there because it can't be too overcrowded, but I do want to have a freaking koi fish pond up there now. Maybe around the bird bath. Oh, that'd be so cool. But I'm gonna take... This is rainbow. Ow! Rainbow. There you go. Um, 
I think I'm gonna take out... Yeah, they can't really swim freely and it makes me sad. I'm gonna take it out. I don't have enough dirt though. I need to go grab a little more dirt. And I really want to do this. Maybe, maybe I could have my koi fish, another koi fish pond down below um, where the waterfall is, but we can actually make a path that goes down there. We can make it look really pretty. I think I'm going to do that. I'm excited. I'm going to do that. Oh, I'm running out of, I don't have any more food. I'm hungry. Okay. So let me collect all of this dirt. And when I do have a child, we already have a house built for them over there. I'm not gonna rebuild it. They're not gonna know that I had a daughter before. I'm gonna keep that completely secret. And they're not gonna know that I have a cemetery grounds for all of my dead animals and <laughs> husbands and children. Cause that would scare them. And I don't wanna be scary. Mommy doesn't wanna be scary. Okay, I think that's enough. Um, I, oh, kitty, you're not the color I want, but I would totally get you if you were white or black or gray. I'm still, I still need to have all the kittens. I have not had all three of them at the same time. Um, okay. So I'm going to get rid of the coral reef and I'm just going to put it, I, I think I'll put it in my, my pond down there. Cause this is, the space is just a little too small. And they're just a little sad down here. So let's get rid of this. Nobody swim in my way because you will get killed. Okay, little fishy. And the coral reef kind of messes with with the pool of the, the water. So all the little fishes get... Don't get in there, Vegas. You will hurt yourself. See, look. I don't know why it does that. Get... No. There he goes. I don't know why it's doing that. Ow! Did someone bite me? What? How did that happen? <laughs> okay. There we go. Okay, so we have fishes in there and I'm going to grab my glass. But before, I need to make some food. Let's make some bread. I'm gonna have to really be on top of harvesting now because now that my thing doesn't work anymore, I can only feed my dinos wheat. They don't eat ferns anymore. And I wonder if I could put a fish in there. Can I put a water, can I put water in that fish bowl now? No, no, it's on my head. Why is it on my head? I don't want it on my head. I wanted to put water in it. No, you're ruining my torches. Get. And then all the fish bowls over there. We'll just leave that fish bowl, the wandering fish bowl. And where's my torch? Okay, we gotta put the torch down because we can't let it be too dark. Okay, put it there. Um, I'm gonna put on display, let's put some buckets. Mr. Bucket, I could stack them? Whoa, that's cool. You could stack them. Oh, well, of course, I stacked the iron. Okay, let's see, let's grab our glass. No, the glass, give me. Okay, and we're gonna put the glass over this and hopefully the fish don't drown. <laughs> drown. I meant like run out of water or not water because you know how you're supposed to put like bubbles in the thing there needs to be some sort of oxygen in there for something we'll see if this works the fish will not drown I mean I mean that is questionable if you pull a fish backwards in water does that mean that they drown underwater or they suffocate. I don't know. Okay, well, this is working out. I'm gonna grab, I think I don't know if I have any more glass. I have this, but I don't, mm. I'm gonna put the coral reef on display right now. So let's put this on display just for a bit. No, that's not, you need, you're not coral there. And I will put that down. Um, in my little, I'm gonna make a, another koi fish pond there. Um, do I have any sand to make some glass? I think I may have glass upstairs. Let's go check. Do I? Not there. 
I don't have any. Oh, here's some sand. Okay. Well, I can put that to bar burn, to cook, turn it into some glass, and then we can finish off um, this. This looks really cool. I'm really happy. Whoa, that corner is really dark. I need to uh, put a torch there or something. Let's put a torch over here. Something can totally spawn in this house. Bad. Okay, so this is looking really cool, and this is pretty impressive. I can add fish if I like, but I think I'm cool with just this amount. That's so cool. All right. Um, so now, oh, we should get rid of this. Where did I put? Let's just let's just do this. There we go. So we don't have this big old water patch in my house randomly. Uh, we should have enough glass by now. Where did I put it? Which one? Here it is. Okay, perfect. So we're completely done with this. And I can catch more. Oh, no, we're not. I need to do two more. I can catch more fish, though. And put them... I want a, a, a little koi fish pond where it's open and I could see them swimming from the top. And there's, like, flowers and it's a pretty garden around it. So, I, dang, I really want to work on... Do I have a lot of cobblestone? Because I want to make a lot of the stone paths so I can put that in my garden. Oh, here we go. We have a lot. All right. So I'm going to make some more of those. I have some downstairs, I think, over here. There we go. And I'm going to make some more. Oh, there's more in there also. Okay. So I think it was just... There it goes. That's easy. That's a lot already. Oh my God. Um, let us get rid of the wood I got. No, let's get rid of an egg. I need to put this stuff away though. So I'm gonna put that down. I don't need this. I need to really organize my chests. Okay, whatever. I'll put crab meat in the fridge. Let's put that in the fridge, keep it nice and cold. Um, we'll put our bread away and our wheat. No, you go there. Okay. And I think I could throw this away. I don't know why. It's just taking space. And we could put on display, um, we could put this. There we go. And these stone tablets, I need to, to get rid of them. And I'll get rid of the couch as well. I'll put the shears up there too. And a flower. There. I love the way that these shelves look. It looks so cool. Okay, um, so I'm gonna go upstairs. Don't pick that up. And I did I gather I did gather a bunch of flowers. Well, at least let's see. The purples, those are flowers up there. So and we could even put some cacti. Well, I don't know if I want to put cacti because they grow and they hurt. So let's just gather these and um, I can plant some flowers upstairs. Is it turning nighttime already? The sun is setting. Okay, so let's just go ahead and sleep. Sleepy time and another sip of coffee. It's starting to get cold. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I really want to make this garden pretty. And I don't want too much water. So the koi fish pond, oh look, there's a cat down there. I need to really light up the area if I'm gonna have um, koi fish down there that I'm gonna really care about. So, I kind of want this path to be stone. I don't want it to be glass anymore. What a waste of glass. Maybe we can have all of the ones leading out, leading up to the path in stone. And then maybe we can just have the stone go around like you can walk around. Um, so I'm gonna have to put some dirt down. I'm gonna have to get rid of all the glass. Let's get rid of the glass up to, let's just keep the glass as a circle. So we'll place down some dirt because I'm gonna put some cobblestone over this or the stone pathway and it's gonna look awesome. So we're gonna keep a glass of circle, a uh, circle of glass. And I think that's good. And we'll put down stone all right here. Is that it? No. 
There we go. Okay, and then... Hello, little crab. I like the way it looks. It has more contrast in it. So let's do that for all the sides. I kind of want to expand it. I want to expand my garden. I want it to be beautiful. Oh, little crab. Be careful, little crab. You're going to fall. It's okay. You're not mine anyways. You're not my pet. Okay. Let's put this down. There we go. There we go. Okay. Looking better already. Okay, so two more to go. Maybe we'll work on our other koi fish pond later. We'll go, uh, yeah, before, we'll just go, oops, we'll just go mingle uh, with the villagers. I kind of want to show you guys the other village that I found. It's not too, too far, especially when I fly on my horse. And now that I know where I'm going and where I need to go to get back and how to get back, it's not, um, it's not that bad. I can get home really quickly because I know where I'm going. Okay. So I think I'm going to put a stone. You know what? Aren't there hedges or something that for the garden? Let's see. H E D. Oh, there is oak hedge. I wonder how that looks. I just gave myself some. I'll make them after, but I just want to see how they look. Oh, they're just little mini ones. I mean, they look better. They look a lot more like a garden is supposed to. Okay, so I'm gonna just let's get rid of them. I'm gonna have to, uh, how do you make one? I'm pretty sure, oops. H E, there we go. Okay, so I can just get rid of these leaves and put the hedges in instead. Okay, so let's put down the stone. Stone walkway. I wonder if the stone walkway would be good for our Jurassic, uh, for our park. Let's put these here. I don't think I need, oh, yeah, that, that doesn't work. I don't need too many more. I think that should be fine. And I want to have the pathways kind of I don't know, should I have it all the way to the middle? And then a pretty little bird bath in the center? I don't know if I want that water anymore. I just don't know. Maybe a little bit of water, but it's kind of in the way of us being able to see the center, which should be like the really pretty part, right, Mr. Pig? Right? I think I'm gonna do, well, I think I'll get rid of that, but we'll do it later. I can put, I'm gonna put my dirt. The dirt is gonna go all the way to the center. Cause I like it, I like the way it looks. Pig, no, get out. Get out of here. <laughs> you're just hopping, now you're just crying out for attention, okay? Okay, so I am gonna do that. We'll put some, let's put some flowers down. Let's put some aloe down too, because it's good for healing stuff. Wait, is the aloe the stuff that's only underwater? I think it is. I was completely wrong. It's a different, a different type of aloe. Okay. So we have some more flowers down. And I wish that we could put, like, flowers on the hedges or something. I really like... Hmm. I'm kind of thinking, like, I feel like the space looks way small. Smaller than it should look. And I think it may be because of these. Do I really, are they really necessary? Cause I like the way these look when they go over. So maybe I might like it better with those not even there. I'm gonna just take them down. I don't know what the point of them being there was for. I mean, it was for decoration, but I'm kind of getting tired of it. Things change. So, oh, we need another, okay, yes, good. Things change, and ideas change, and change is okay. So, I'm gonna just, um, I guess, what is the term? Remodel? We're remodeling. It already looks better already. It's so much more open space. I do like it a lot better. Okay, so let's get rid of this. I'm trying to remodel and make my house look good so I can impress my husband, Mr. Piggy. I don't have any more dirt, though, so I can't knock down the last 
Okay. It does look way better. I like it a lot better. And I'm gonna put more flowers. I think I may... You know what I think it is? I think I want to put the water dripping from the sides because it just obstructs your view. Like right when you walk in, you see this water, but I want to be able to see it from the, from the sides so that I don't, it doesn't get in the way of my path. So let's do that. I'm gonna get rid of this and then we're gonna go pay a visit to our village. Let's go pay a visit to our villages. The different villages around our house. I can't believe I found another village, and it was actually really close to the other village. The snowy village, but it's just on a lake. Um, I want to make sure that the... No! I didn't mean to do that. I want to make sure that the day is brand new, so we don't run out of daytime. Okay. So there is... This looks a lot better already. I really like this thing. But I want to move the water, and I want to get rid of the vines. Or maybe move the vines somewhere else. Did someone fall? What? Patty! Oh, oh, he's okay. Alright. Cool, false alarm. I'm gonna harvest, let's harvest a little bit of crops before we go. Um, because our dinos need to eat that. And when I get a daughter and a son, I'm gonna make one a farmer and one a fisherman. Maybe the guy will be a fisherman and the woman will be a farmer. <sighs> because last time our daughter died while fishing. <laughs> and none of them are going to be a miner because that wasn't... There was like no... There's no way of avoiding that. You can never know if there, there's going to be lava on the other side. And they don't have any defenses against that. Unless they're carrying a bucket of water with them. But I don't think they would even drop it. They're not that smart. Okay, so that's good. Let's go ahead and I should be able to, s no, the sun is not setting. Set faster. Okay, cool. So I'm happy with the way this is looking. It looks really nice already. And I think I wanna put stone on the outside here too, on this little pathway. Let's do it. Let's just do it. Just do it. This is uneven. Why is that there? Okay, let's put some stone right here. Oh, no, we can't. We can't do that with, can't do that with a cactus there. Darn it. Let's get rid of this. There we go. We have to put the cacti there. I guess I can just put it on this right here. And then we can put it like that. I mean, it's something to walk on. It looks nice. There. Okay. I don't know why. I really like the stone. Um, walkway thingies. Let's go. The sun is going to set soon. But I, you know what? No, we got to come bearing gifts. We have to come bearing gifts to the villagers. Um, so that we, they know that we're good neighbors. They know that we're good neighbors and I can attract one of them. <laughs> um, I'm going to put, okay, so let's see. What am I going to put down? Put our cacti, our flowers. I'm gonna keep the net with me and my fishing rod. Um, we'll put the glowstone and a cactus down. So I like how you can just click it into place. You don't have to go. Oh, I didn't want the seeds in there. I don't want those. Let's put those in there. Yay! Okay, cool. And the seeds are really dark. Uh, okay, so the cacti we'll put down too. We'll put in there. Okay. Awesome! And let's grab some iron. We'll give them some iron gifts. And I'm gonna take a nap. And then first thing in the morning, we're gonna go and visit and um, try to find a husband. So we already have some people who liked us. But I don't wanna buy my love, like I said last time. Don't wanna buy my love. I do wanna go show you guys. You know what? We should go to the other village, though. So that I could take the books. Because <laughs> I want the books. And you know what? I should just farm their crops too. And then replant them. Like a good person. Let's do that. Alright horse. You ready to go? Let's go out for a ride. Let's go show you the world. Uh, come on horses. Don't be jelly. You'll get... I'll take you out soon sometime too. Okay. So. Let's go to the... 
Well, they're in the same direction. The Snow Village and Lake Village. And let's just go visit them there. I, I want to go there because I want their books. But we'll go introduce ourselves to the villagers as well. Our other village is over there. Sand Village. Snow Village. Lake Village. You guys love how <laughs> creative I am with these village names. Okay, so I'm going to cut this out. And Oh, actually, no. I can't. This is Oasis. I completely forgot. Well, we can take a journey, a grave adventure, to the villages far, far away. I don't even know how I got this far. You know what? Since I'm going so far, we're going to go over the great sea, the great ocean. There is one very large ocean here. Well, actually, I am, like, surrounded by a humongous ocean. You guys are going to see it right now. But I should just collect some coral reef while I'm out here, too. Um, okay. I hate when my cat does this. <laughs> Navi! Like, it's one thing to sit on my desk, but when you want to clean yourself grossly right in front of me, I don't like that. Homie, don't play that. Okay. So, Lake Village is actually further than Snow Village, which is weird. Oh, someone's dying. Because we found Lake Village first. And I was totally, way completely far away. So off course. I don't know how that happened. Um, and I would have been completely lost if I didn't look at the coordinates. Um, but I'm glad I looked at those. I'm glad I had other saves too. Because I look stupid. I don't know why the compass doesn't work. So it's not my fault. Oh, look. Tropical. Over there. We have a tropical place. Closer than I thought, but there is this trop the tropical place that I marked down over here. It's not this one. Wow, there's another one. Didn't even realize that. Did I even fly this way? Okay, so here's Snow Village, but the other tropical place over there is so epic looking. Maybe we'll take a trip out there. So we're flying in. Look at their look at how uh how awesome their farms are. Hi, stranger. Hi, Rachel. Let's talk to Rachel. Let's chat. You completely agree. Let's tell her a joke. No, don't take offense. Let's chat. Okay, she's still a negative. Oh god, I should have left when I could. <laughs> when I should have. Look, guys, it's Steve. Hey, Steve the miner. Let's chat. Hi. No, I haven't seen any emeralds. I do have nice stories. And Robin. Uh, we're gonna just chat a little bit with them. I don't want, oh, this guy is, he's, there's a girl. She's stuck in the, are you stuck in the water? Why would I say something like that? Because you are stuck in the water. I think this is the village. This is a snowy village. Um, I guess, no, we did find the snow village before the lake village. Oh, look, a puppy. So I want to show you this other village. Let's go. Their crops aren't even fully grown, so I can't farm them. But we had already met those people. Um, there's another village over here that I haven't talked to any of them. So we'll see how their hearts are. Imagine I, imagine I fall deeply in love with someone over here at this village. Long distance relationships do not work out, okay? After a certain point. I mean, they will for a small amount of time, but it doesn't work. You have to be there, you know? Um, and live with each other and all that great stuff. So I don't know if this person would have to travel far, far away with me. I, th uh, I can ride Chibi, my elephant. I don't think I could have two people on one horse. All right, so we're at another village. Um, oh, hello. Whoa, there's a lot of people here. Oh my gosh. Everybody's talking to me at one time. Is that a guy or who's dying? Who's dying? Don't kill yourself. Get out of there. Oh my gosh, help him. Help him, get up, get out of the water. No. No, don't kill yourself. You could be my soulmate. Get up. Okay. 
Okay, he got some air at least. And he hit me. No, Drew, you didn't do anything to me, but I'm saving your life. This is dangerous. This is dangerous. Drew needs to... Drew needs to get out of the water. Get out of the water. There you go. There you go, Drew. There you go. We're helping. We're helping this village. This is the village. No! Drew! Drew, get out of there. Get. Come on. Get up. You can't live underwater forever, Drew. You can't live underwater forever. Come on. Get. There. There you go. Don't hit me. Don't. Don't you try to hit me anymore. I'm saving your life. Don't walk on there. Don't walk on this ground. You need water. You need air. You can't live under the water. You're not a fish. Now where'd he go? Oh, God. Well, this guy's totally... <laughs> uh, I can't help him. Okay. Hello! Hello! She looks like a cyclops. Hi! Let's chat. You weren't listening. Great. Farmer. Okay, who are you? Hello, Ryan. The farmer? Okay, you're mean. Let's not talk to you. Hello, Anna. Everyone thinks I'm so... Yeah, I know I did say it. it looks like you have a cyclops eye. I am sorry. Um, but it's true. <laughs> Let me get on my horse. Let's get on my horse and fly over here. Just stay on the land, horse. This village is overpopulated, guys. Oh, look at these blushy cheeks. This is Kimberly the farmer. Mm-hmm. You look like a butcher. You're wearing a butcher thing. Oops. Hey, Gwen. And, oh look, Alice, another butcher looking girl. Oh, oh, are you looking at that? What is that, an ant? What is that? Jesus. <laughs> Christopher. No, it's Vincent. Whoa. I have a weapon just letting you know. Okay. You, uh, why are you being so mean to me? Are you Sean? Hi, Sean. There's so many people around here. Um, so who else is all up in here? Is this guy stuck in this house? Are you stuck in there? Let's check what's around here. This village is pretty cute. Hello! Little ant. Fire ant. Let's see. I can't approach them with a weapon. That'd be very scary. Okay. So there's like way too many people in this village. I think, oh look, here, there's a person who I haven't met. Melody, the garden. She looks really cute. She's a sword. And she looks kind of looks like Link from Zelda. Um, people are taking a swim. Lucas. These people are pretty friendly. This town has a ton of guards. Lola. And I already talked to Gwen. Gwen. Okay, so I don't know. Oh, look. I want to marry. Oh, did I interrupt something? Did I interrupt something between you two? The baker? Oh, I didn't know there was a baker. What? Let's joke with her. No, it's not terrible. No! Oh, God. Okay. I don't want to ruin my reputation. I want to get stuff from them. But, well, okay. There is the books. There is the books. That's what I came for. How do I get in there? No one can get in. <laughs> no one can get in their poor library. And Cupquake just came to steal the books. There we go. Okay. Uh, I don't know if there's any more books. Oh, there's a bald guy. Hey, bald guy. The priest. Tony the priest wasn't listening. Okay, I'll leave you alone. Is there any more books around? Let's go fly. And see if there's any books. I think I took them all. I'm trying to look, peek through the houses. Okay, so. I didn't have... Oh, look. Oh, no, that's a fox. I thought it was a guy who was running away from the village. <laughs> Um, so, I didn't have any one single love interest with someone there. No one really caught my eye. The village is a little overpopulated as well. I didn't even get their crops. I don't think they were full. 
fully grown anyways. But I think it's just safe to say that the best mate for me is probably at Sand Village. Just because it's not long distance. If he misses his family, because he's going to live at my oasis. If he misses his family, we can go visit, you know, for the weekend or something. <laughs> And two, I don't have to travel far, far, long, long distances to bring him home. So it won't be like a mission to bring him to the house, to the oasis house. So here is another tropical place. I should have got, I don't, I didn't see any of the coral reef. I didn't fly over it, I guess. But I'm going to go home. And uh, I, I will, in the next episode, go to Sand Village first thing and try to see if we can chat. I, I wonder if there, if there, if it is possible to bring up your reputation with someone, not by giving gifts, but just by talking. I think that you have to like do constant visits with them, like daily visits and just talk to them and stuff. Maybe it'll build a better relationship. I don't know, you never know, but I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. I'm gonna fly away. To the beautiful night sky. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all have an awesome remainder of your weekend. I am Cupquake, and I will see you all later. Bye!